How's it going everyone? It's Sam. Today I'm talking about something that I really haven't talked about much on the channel before and that's a option strategy. Now I am going to try to keep this short because I've tried this a couple times and I'll be honest I don't I don't buy and sell options very often really at all but there's something coming up that's so attractive and I do have money sitting on the sidelines I feel like I almost have to take advantage of this and I want to talk to you about it here today. So if you guys don't mind hitting the like button and subscribe button, I appreciate that. There's a link down there to Moomoo. They're giving you a special offer when you sign up and start depositing. I'll talk more about that towards the end of the video, but uh, I would definitely take advantage of it if you haven't already. Now, three companies I have been buying a lot of recently are Alphabet, Tesla, and Amazon. This video is not to explain why they're in such a good position uh, as a company or the balance sheet or the cash flows. And I'm not trying to explain why I like these companies. You can pick your own companies. If you want some other company instead of these, you could do it with a VOO. You could do it with an index fund if you really want to. But these three companies, I think are really attractively valued and their volatility is quite high right now, which is why I'm looking at this strategy. And it might seem simple uh, to a lot of people, I think it is simple, which is one of the reasons I like it. So if you don't know what options are, you can do some research. Basically a call is the ability to buy a share at a certain price by a certain date. So what you can do is you can sell calls and you get something called a premium. Someone pays you for the right to buy your shares at a certain price. Now I've been looking at these three companies and buying some extra shares with the cash I have sitting around right now to collect premiums. So right now, if you want to sell calls at 10% above the price that they're at today, uh, these companies, these are the premiums you'd get. For Amazon, uh, if you went 30 days out at an option strike price 10% above the price that it's at today, you get nearly $5,000. Google has less volatility. It would pay you $2,300 because again, it doesn't fluctuate in price as much. And then Tesla is extremely volatile. It would pay you nearly uh, $3,600. Now you might be saying, well, it's actually more volatile than Amazon, but why isn't it paying you as much? Because it's much more volatile. Well, that's because the price itself of Tesla shares is a lot lower. So you can make a very significant ROI. You would have to buy 100 of each of these shares though to sell calls, which is uh, the barrier that a lot of people can't get over. So for example, uh, Tesla to buy 100 shares will cost $66,500, but you can make $43,000 in annual income from selling calls. And these option strike prices are a little bit arbitrary. You could set this for 20% uh, out of the money. You could set it for 2%. Uh, the closer you are to today's prices, the more premium you'll get, but also the less um, likely that you'll actually be able to hold on to your shares because if it bounces up, you'll lose your shares. You basically sell them at that price and you get the premium. So, so I set them for 10% just because it's a nice round number. I don't know if that's the best option or the best uh, strategy, I should say, because I don't trade options all that much. I'm sure it has to do too with how, like, uh, if there are key resistances and supports, but this is just an example. So with this in mind, you can make $130,000 with today's volatility and premiums and such, you can make $130,000. The problem is you'd have to pay $500,000 to get all these shares, 100 shares of Tesla, 100 shares of Google, 100 shares of Amazon. So most people can't do this, but this is a 26% ROI, just on the premiums, you get 26% of your portfolio's value. Now, what's coming up soon though, is gonna make this a lot easier. Soon, each of these companies is going to have a stock split. So Amazon is going to vote on their stock split. It's gonna happen June 3 if it gets approved. Google's is gonna either be July 1 or July 15. I've seen both, uh, but, <clears throat> but they're going to have a stock split as well, assuming it gets approved. And both of these are 20 for one. So instead of $2,000 per share, it's gonna be basically 100. Uh, Tesla also is going to vote on one towards the end of the year. It'll probably get approved. All these will probably be approved. Last time they did a five to one stock split. And I think that would make sense again with the prices that they're at, uh, just because it's in that $100 range. And a lot of companies like to be around 100, 150, $200, something like that. Because it makes it easier for individual investors to buy. Uh, so uh, there are other reasons for it as well, but that's 
one of the main reasons. Now, the cool thing is that makes it a lot easier to buy all these shares because instead of paying $200,000 to be able to sell a call because you need 100 shares again, instead it will cost $10,000. Now, that doesn't mean that the premiums are gonna stay the same. They're gonna be basically cut down by the same amount. So the ROI, the return on investment is gonna be the same, but the cost is gonna be a lot less. So you'll be able to get into it a lot easier. So now you could buy these shares. You could buy 20 shares of Tesla at today's prices. You could buy uh, five shares of Google, five shares of Amazon. This would be your cost. Overall, you'd spend about $35,000. You'd have an annual income of about $13,000. That's awesome, right? That's, that is a premium that you get paid. You would get paid about 1100 every single month, which is fantastic. Some of the risks of this though, uh, and there are risks, we could have the market fall. So this is, if, if you're gonna do it like I'm gonna do it, right? You have money sitting on the sidelines, uh, the market could fall. And then instead of being able to buy those shares at the decreased price, you already bought them early. So let's say all of a sudden the market gets cut in half, well, you would have double the buying power. You could have bought double the shares of Amazon and Google and Tesla, but instead you just have those original shares that you bought at twice the price. But that's always a risk of the market. If that happened, the premiums would also fall, right? Uh, the, the amount that you get paid per option contract would be lower as well. Now, another risk, and this has always been the risk that I've been more worried about, is that the market bounces. Like I've always been really bullish on the market. so. Uh, if the market bounces, let's say all of a sudden Tesla goes up 50% in the next month, right? You lose out on a lot of that upside. So you would have to sell them at $731.50. You get the premium, so you get that extra boost, but you'd be capped out there. So you lose out on some of the price appreciation, unfortunately, right? But that is the risk that you take. Now, best case scenario, it goes up eight or nine percent and uh, you don't actually have to sell those shares but you get a premium that's fantastic because let's say that happened every single month you went up eight percent or seven percent uh, because there's going to be compounding the share prices would basically double in a year and you get premium the whole way you never have to get rid of those shares now uh, another interesting scenario would be uh, because some of these aren't happening soon right uh, like google's a couple months away Tesla is going to happen at the end of the year. Let's say you go buy these different options contract, or you buy these shares, I should say. Uh, you buy these shares on Monday. Then you have to wait a little bit of time to actually sell the calls because you don't have enough shares. But assuming they split, you will. You buy these Monday, the price is double. Like over the next couple months, the market rebounds and everything does really well. Maybe Amazon and Google don't double, but they go up 30, 40%. And then you can start selling the premiums because you have to wait a while uh, for these splits to happen anyways. So the market rebounds, everything goes up, your premiums will also go up uh, and there will be a lot of volatility as well if the market starts racing off, a lot of people will wanna buy calls, right? Uh, a lot of people are also buying calls now because they think the market right, might rebound because it's been so oversold. But there would be a lot of volatility. The price appreciation would happen and you still get to hold on to your shares because you haven't sold any calls yet. Now, this is all my opinion. I'm not I'm not an expert in options by any means, but I thought this was a great strategy because of these splits coming up. It's going to become a lot easier for retail investors to jump in and it pays a significant amount of money. There's a lot of volatility. You lose out on some upside potential, uh, but that's why I'm not gonna move my whole portfolio over here. I just wanted to do this with a chunk of my money because I think it does pay really well. And uh, I think it's definitely worth the risk because let's say these companies keep on falling. I still think they're at great valuations now. I, I'm not buying them at all time highs. I'm not buying them when they're severely overvalued. A lot of these have been beaten down. Uh, let's say they go off to the races and they move back up. Well, that was going to be cashing in in my uh, bank account anyway, so it wouldn't have done anything for me. At least this way, I get a, uh, I get at least 10% upside on the strike prices, uh, and I also get the premiums. So that I think is a great, a great option for you if you do want to do something with your money. Uh, I realized too that $35,000 might be a lot of money for a lot of people. It really is a lot of money. So maybe you do this with just one company. 
right? Maybe you can get uh, 20 shares of Tesla or five shares of Google or Amazon. Maybe you just wanna run it with one of the companies. I just found that this was a really interesting option or <laughs> I need to stop saying option. A very interesting thing that you could do with your money and it becomes a lot easier here soon. And maybe you wanna do it with some other company right? Like Palantir or VOL, you want to do it with an index fund. There are a lot of different ways to do it. Uh, a lot of it just comes down to the volatility, where you think these companies are going in the future, uh, what's your risk level and that kind of thing. Now, selling calls is a safer option. It's one of the safest options in the stock market uh, for trading options. It's not buying calls. Um, it's not selling naked puts or anything like that. It's, uh, it's something that is much safer, which is one of the reasons I'm looking at it as well too. So let me know your thoughts on this underneath the video. I do wanna thank Moomoo for sponsoring this video and I do wanna to talk to you about how you can make some free money. Now, before we go any further, I actually have a extra bonus for you if you sign up with Moomoo. They allow you to get a lot of information right on one specific stock. You can see here, obviously, you can see quotes. There's news, I get up-to-date news on whatever stock I wanna look at. Right now I'm looking at CleanSpark, one of my favorite miners. I can get detailed analysis from short sell analysis and price versus short interest to technical indicators, whether we're overbought, oversold, fundamental indicators. I can take a look at what analysts are saying and the target price of different analysts. And one other thing is you can even take a look at the ETFs that hold it in the percent changes recently, which makes it really easy because all this stuff is in one place. So right now, if you use the link underneath the video, you can get up to five free stocks plus a free share of Twitter. All you have to do is deposit $2,000 or more and keep it on the platform for 30 days. Now, this is an exclusive new bonus. It's not gonna be here very much longer, so I would highly suggest clicking the link underneath the video. So thank you everyone for watching the video. Sorry if I stumbled through this a little bit. I'm not super comfortable talking about options because I don't do it very often, but I did want to show uh, an awesome strategy that can pay you a significant amount each month. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.